Uh, wealthy tramp, you do the stream and BF1. Why do you equip other people's guns and drop them? Great gameplay, thank you. Ah, oh, it's because they have gadgets that I want to use. That I like, for example, if I want to heal myself, I pick up a medikit. If I want to, if I have access to it, uh, mostly is to uh, to drop ammo from a support kit, but also to uh, shoot the flare from a uh, from a scout Ouch. kit. Yeah, f because I play uh, assault. So the problem with me is that I can't heal myself, I can't resupply myself, and I can't use flares. But if this guy die here, the guy in front of me, I pick up his kit, I can shoot a flare. And then I pick my kit up again, and then I can see where the enemies are, and I can wreck them hard. Or revive your teammates. <laughs> or I can revive you, yeah, yeah, I do that sometimes. Hopefully I'll show you uh, when I do that. I pick up a kit, a med kit, revive a teammate, and... You made videos about that in the past? I, I yeah, yeah, I did, I did. It never got all that popular because... Yeah. Because Reddit warriors, they think that uh, that is a bad idea. <laughs> yeah. And uh, Reddit rules, guys. Hi guys, it's Matty Ace. So, I decided to kind of start off this round a little bit differently compared to how I normally do it. I'm going on a rather massive flank here, which in itself is not all that unusual. I flank all the time, but I normally don't flank this early on in a match. Now, this might seem like a good idea from time to time, but looking back at this, I realized that maybe I should have started the way I normally do, going for the initial flags. And despite the fact that I'm getting quite a number of kills here in the beginning of the game, our team still have major problems getting an even amount of flags as our opponents. Now, one of the weapons that you're probably going to see a lot in the future is this one, the Rybe Rolls 1918 Factory. But it's not going to be the only assault weapon that I will be using, and I'm not going to uh, have uh, the 100 service stars as, a, as an equally important goal as I've had in the past. I'm going to switch this weapon up with, for example, the Model 10A Hunter, which is a weapon that I have about 5,000 kills with, and I'm also going to use, I think, the uh, Hellriegel, uh, not the factory version, uh, the defensive ver version, the one with 120 bullets, and a few other weapons actually. So the next hundred service stars is probably gonna take a while. <laughs> so the flame pooper with a pistol. <laughs> oh, that's nice to do. You don't have much medics now. No. Oh flags. <laughs> medics or flags, yeah. So now, going back to what I said in the very beginning of this video, I am one of those players that switch kits quite frequently, and I do that for a variety of different reasons. So now, one of the first things that I check out once I do pick up another kit is what gadgets that kit has. In this case, it has tripwires along with the flare gun, and obviously both of those gadgets are useful, but for different reasons. However, just like with mines, if an enemy shoots a tripwire or a mine that belongs to my team or myself, then what happens is that when this tripwire or mine explodes, the damage will be for the enemy team, meaning it will damage me or any of my nearby teammates. No, that grenade killed me because I put up that those tripwires. That I would have I would have survived it if it wasn't for my own tripwires. Now, going back to service stars, what's going to decide how long it will take for me to get 100 service stars with the Model 10A Hunter is probably the amount of times I get to play on this particular map, Aragon Forest. Because so far, this is the only map where I have consistently used this or any other shotgun. Oh, the, to the right. I hit it once, but he one shot me. I think I'm near it. Yeah, I'm near it. All right. I'll... So here, I would like you to pay attention to how I'm switching from the incendiary grenade to the light anti-tank grenade. And that is because Resolve here has a perfect spawn for me to take this tank out. Hit 
Okay, do you see the horse on the front left? There is a horse on the left. Nice. Okay. Oblivious sniper. <laughs> Oh, nice. One more on the left. Uh, take him. Probably. Whoa. What? Oh yeah, that, that makes sense, that flare gun. That makes perfect sense. So yeah, this video will continue with some more mixed infantry moments. I hope you will enjoy it. My name is Matthias, and I want to thank you all for watching. Bomber. Where are they? Uh, over Delta. Over the train. Yeah, over, over the train. That's the important part. Oh. Uh, Bravo seems to be quite crowded. Another Shimon in their spawn. Yeah. A fighter just spawned. Yeah. Shooting at you. Table. <laughs> <laughs> That's effective. <laughs> yeah. Many bomber going back to their spawn. The left. Nice. That tank hunter is really great. It's so much fun. Table that tank. You get it? You get the tank. Why am I not deployed? Are you serious? And a third guy. Holy. <laughs> Always in this game, I'm like, oh, my left flank is covered. There's three friendlies looking there. Yeah, so they're not gonna do anything. But nope. Die because the guy didn't shoot at the enemy. Oh my goodness, yo! Oh, oh I see. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I heard him behind me and my started to pucker. Oh, behind you. I got him, wait, I'll really. Thanks. Ooh, on the left tank? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can take this uh, shotgun, maybe. Here, I'll switch on here. I got it, I got his shotgun. Uh -huh. Oh, I'm... Quick. Uh, bunch of... Uh, you uh, can't be revived now, right? Left. Yeah, I'm oh, dead. he's low. Can't shoot him, he's low. Medic spotted, yep. Yeah, there's so many there. A lot of mortars. How am I missing? We have taken objective Edward. There's a field down there. Uh, I'm gonna repair you. Halfway there, we have the upper hand. 
Aha, sana bir sıhhi yardım çantası. Orada bir makine otu pek var. <gülüyor> nice. Şu yardım çantasını kullan. I'll take this horse. Uh, anybody damn it? Sıhhi yardım çantası. Sıhhi yardım çantası. Tedavi ol. Be good point. How are you doing, my friend? Whoa, there's a lot of many there. Yeah, there's a lot in the buildings by uh, the track side. Oh, okay. Bravo. Hiding in these buildings. That's what's going on the left. I'm gonna go down there, because I like that side. Oh, come on. Oh, wait. No, I was going to revive him. Oh, you can revive me. Oh, it's starting. It's gonna be in range if he moves forward. Gonna back a little. 